seamless. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so, um, yeah, Dragon Ball Fighter Z really got me into playing characters that I thought I would never play through the offline mode, so it's done its job very well. There's arcade ladders as well. Uh, I really dig the style and the method and the system. I really get it as well because they in depth tell you how all the mechanics work and force you to. In oh, oh, you, oh, that, oh, I don't like that. Oh, don't like that either. Cosmos. is a bit of a bastard because he does this big jump and can't reach him. And he's just up there now. So you have to find a way to get him. I really like this world, I always thought this world was very pretty. if I remember. Oh, I can't see anymore. Gimme. Gimme, you bastard. Gimme. Oh. 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 Yeah. Set fire to his ass. I forget what the dragon eggs even do. It's just something else to collect. And I always forgot in the original game. I thought they unlocked art or something. Or like... guys are like doing a load of terraforming. I mean something else. Gambit? I don't want it. High caves. Yeah, I just really like this world. It was always one of my favorites. There's also Dreamweavers later, which I really like as well. Very magical. Like the first world really ex gives you an example of what the worlds are going to be like. Well, you know, the basics of the game, and then like the next one ramps up a little bit. It's got a good, like... Another flight level. 
Uh, yeah, uh, what's he say? Oh, yeah, that's where I can go. Check down here. Oh, and they got these little wizards. have different like things that they want you to do but that means you can just leave certain areas I haven't even finished a single level here and I can go straight because I've been collecting so many of these eggs from before because I just keep massacring these uh, thieves because of their na -na 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 -nas. and I'm like no no you must die so that one I have to supercharge that's crystal flight. So I have to come down here and take a hard thing with the thing, and I'm not ready to make that kind of commitment, so. Uh, oh. Yeah, I need those. Uh, what's he doing all on his own? Wow. I've got as much as I can from here. Ooh. Oh, there's nothing down there. Ooh, there's something up there, though. Can I get up there another way? No, I cannot. Let's try and glide around. This is going to go horribly because I don't think this is what is intended. Oh, it is. Maybe. Literally just have to get him before a single circuit. You have to get him to reset. Oh you Oh I nearly had him. doesn't react fast enough. Haha. <laughs> Got me egg. Ah, and it happened again. Wait, what? Ah, everything's connected. Like the matrix. 
Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, so I'm having great fun with Dragon Ball Fighter Z, but I'm not going to be streaming it very much or live streaming it, uh, putting it on my YouTubes very much, other than when I, when, if I get pretty good at it, so I can, like, show off some cool combo shit and play against the computer at a fairly high-ish level, because it's just like, uh, a lot of the, like, stuff is, like, the little dude in the corners going, you're now entering a block scene for, like, every single exchange they have that's not a fight. Like, everything in the story mode is blocked. And, yeah, I'm using OBS to record this stuff, so I'm not using the PS4's recorder. But you're thinking, if they blocked it, I'll probably get copyright struck every single time. It's not worth me even fucking trying. So I'm not going to be doing story mode of Dragon Ball Z anytime soon. Maybe some arcade modes. I'd probably definitely take more than one here. These guys ride them. Why is everything a body slam in this? Yeah, it got me really interested, like, in, um... It got me really interested in playing characters that I normally wouldn't be interested in at all, where it's like, I like the androids, but I never felt like I wanted to play them in the game. And then they're like, oh, you're going to get to play as the android soon. And I'm like, oh, you know what? That might be interesting. Interesting. Beast Makers is a great uh, world as well in this. These guys' magic powers is to walk slowly towards you and twat you around the head with a stick. Just keep that in mind. Like, this one's waiting patiently for me, so you can come and twat me around the head with a stick. Magic! <laughs> Spyro tier lists of the first trilogy is a little more linear for me in terms of preference. You might have noticed in Crash Bandicoot, oh, they get new moves when he's riding on their back. So this way, and there's this return home portal. So I'm just going to get the, uh, the Durgan. Oh, there's another, oh, Xander. Well. 
yeah, it's a lot more linear, my likes and dislikes of the uh, Spyro Trilogy. You know, I said that I didn't like Crash 2, or like I liked it the least out of the uh, original trilogy, but that's not really saying I hated it. If, with Spyro, it goes, I really liked 1, I really liked 2, but I don't know which one would come higher. I think both were very good. And then 3, I just really didn't care for all that much. And it's just like, you know, I think it's because by that point it kind of passed me by. And I was like, oh yeah, Spyro 3. And recently, well, a few years back now, probably 2014, I played Spyro 3 again, the one on the PS3, the PS3 reissue. And I was like, uh... Yeah, this one holds up the least well, I feel, just personally. Even though it has some pretty neat stuff, it's just, it, being, it doesn't make me excited, you know? Whoa, there's, there's so much that I'm not seeing here. Let's go have a little look around. Can I even go back this way? Looks like it's going to be a hassle go around do the full circle. They often leave hidden ways to circuit back round. Oh, and I can just fly from here. Oh, Eggman! Oh, this is a tricksy tricks. Oh, my obsessive collector's compulsion is being tested here. So, which one do I kill first? Gotta get both of them. Oh, balls. Flame didn't come out. Oh, balls. Oh. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Do it. Oh! It went into look mode. No. No, 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 yes! Toast your butthole. That's a toast your butthole. Close. Let's get a few more coins. Oh yeah, <laughs> I got distracted. Oh, it's Kelvin. I thought it said Kevin then. Kevin the Dragon. Weird dragon. Nope, okay. I'm sure I have, and yeah, whatever. Yes, time for the horrible murder. Uh, okay, I was gonna say, what the fuck? Where's my treasure at? I didn't risk this for nothing. I don't like all this gliding. Pops of the tops. Ah, I get it. Wait. But I still don't have everything. Just water. Water, water. So I'm still missing some stuffs. Uh Maybe up there. Maybe not. Have a little look. Yeah, I think Spyro 1 had a good solid, still has a very good solid, like, world building. Ooh, that's where I came from, right? That's where I... Hmm. 
back to the beginning. Oh, there are dudes. If I get to you, I probably fucked this up, but let's have, let's have a look. I remember these guys, basically. There's guys there. They're everywhere. Too busy doing the critical path. How did I miss this? secret thing over here of warring. Ah, oh, you wizard. You fucking wizard. You're so smart. Why are you dead? Ow. Oh. These guys aren't playing around. Oh, I see. Platforming required. No, I'm bad. Yeah. I win. I win. So what was I saying? Uh... Yeah, so suggestions on where I should go and live next in the comments. I'm thinking of staying in Asia and the Pacific or Eurasian area for the time being. Eurasian, Oceanic area, the way Eurasian came from. Um, for the time being, and then once I've built up some more quals and experience, maybe going and living in Europe for a while, but that really depends on how Brexit handles, because you've got to remember I'm a British citizen, so shit can get fucked real easy for us if they don't do a good deal it'll be very hard for me to work and live in the EU after this so we'll see shame I love Europe but gotta go with the things right ah good job I love a lot of countries and uh, very willing to give multiple a try you know Still young, man. Still really pretty young. Yeah, could be doing this for a while. Oh, well, you can suck a dick. <laughs> high caves. We're gonna get so high, man. Or I'm just gonna shout again. Uh, yeah. Big thing for me that I really liked about the later of Spyro levels, but also felt a lot like filler, was that you could control different characters. And I was like, you know, I really like the penguin that's like also a military. Pretty cool. Uh, uh, yeah, there's a lot of things that I was like, oh, yeah, you know, that's not bad, you know. I'm glad that they had that. Um, I can't remember which Spyro PS2 games I played. I played Enter the Dragonfly, which wasn't great but wasn't as bad as everyone made it out to be. It's just pretty lame. Oh, I like a whirlwind, dude. Ow. Rude. Look at this twisty. Uh, yeah, uh, it, oops, you know, it's... Cyrus. I thought the skateboarding was too much for me. Why would not you do it? You've got better magic. Oh my god. Because platforming, right? God damn it. So yeah, I'm really like getting the itch to move again. I don't know where 
I really like the look of India. When I was in Nepal, that was fun, but I don't know if it would be a fun place to live. <clears throat> just a place to go on holiday, maybe. I don't know. And, you know, it's just time goes by seeing how things go. Uh, yeah. We didn't like the skateboarding on uh, Spyro 3. Uh, and, like, I, it took me a while to get used to the, uh, oh, I put this up. How did you get here, sir? Um. Up in there. Okay. Uh. Berries will carry me. I think, if I remember correctly. I don't want to kill myself. Ajax. Ajax the dragon. I don't like this guy's hat. Uh, yeah, I remember these. I kept dying, and I still have a decent amount of life, so... Mini games of Spyro 2 took a while for me to get used to, I have to admit. But, like, they were fine, it's just some of them were really stressful and really upsetting <laughs> for a child. There's one in one, like, the second game, or there's a second game in the demo, if I remember the demo, uh, with an underwater section. And, like, the whole thing is you're stopping a chef bastard from basically, like, cooking turtles who are literally walking to their deaths. And if you let one fall in, you fail. And it's like, it's kind of like, push the turtles away from their death mini game slot based pushing game. And it used to stress me out so much as a child. I was like, no, I don't want the turtles to die. <laughs> and it used to make me so sad to see them die eventually. It used to make me so stressed and upset. You have no idea. So, yeah, that was never fun. I think I know why those fairies are there, because there's certain areas where you can't get back without falling. But, I'm not sure if they're going to save my ass this time. They did. Oh, that's, that's not a good look. That's not a good look. What, look that, they don't have any animation. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> I was going to die then. Oh, hello. Cedric. Why are they called the high caves? Is it because they're high? Or because they're high? Yeah, I'm not going to stop making that joke. Laugh, laugh, you cretins, laugh. No one's laughing. I'm so confused. Isn't that back the way I came? It's back the way you came. Ooh. Wow, I thought you were a chest. These guys are assholes. That's all I remember. Wrecking these sheeps. Or whatever they are, sheep. Yeah. Yeah, it always used to make me really sad. And, like, how the fuck 
when I'm supposed to make such a sharp turn, I'm kind of confused. Oh, like that. What? It doesn't kill them. Okay. I thought, yeah, because it said invincible, it meant I could wreck them. But, you know. Oh, I can! Yeah! Oh. Wah! No, don't kill me! No, Agog, no! They're fast. Oh, yeah, I remember you. Oh, she he used to go red from embarrassment. But now he actually has like a pattern to him. Before he was just like red with embarrassment, and I was like, oh, that's so cute, because he got kissed by the fairy. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, this is, okay. Give me a smooch. You didn't even touch my face, this bullshit. Why are you frightened of this raw dragon? I don't know why I got it, to be honest, because it's like there's nothing here now. Oh. Oh! Oh, well, he's just freaking out on the geometry anyway. Oh, he's coming to kill me. My cat's also doing an F1 course. No! No, meow! No! Liz! Where am I? What? Huh? We're back here, but that, that doesn't make any sense. Well, I guess we'll go the long way, and then I'll try and uh, get that last arachnoid. Just gotta get into the gems again. Uh, it has so few frames of animation; it's actually upsetting. Get Rick. Better than all of them. Yeah, arachnophobe. They give you that if you if you win. Okay, 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 okay. What am I missing? A lot. I thought I already got two eggs off of this. Okay, let's go find another egg. Ooh. Of these bugs that were just living a quiet life in their homes, so that's that's good. Um, kind of lost. Kind of lost. Oh, I mean, there's nothing to kill. I really hate this chick's hair. She used to have different hair. Now her hair looks dumb. Yeah. Savage. I did high caves. I can't say high caves was ever my favorite. 
No. Oh, it's okay. Is that it? Oh, and you know I've got to go flying out and go somewhere else, don't I? Maybe. Maybe not. I need to go there. Uh, Hello. Oh, thanks. Put me at the top. Oh, that's not the top of my jump at all. Yeah. They knew. That's why they put these two frame gift fairies in. 2000 zero uh, CGI fairies that are somehow so really low in comparison to everything else. Oh, nee, 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 nee. oh yeah, I remember you. You're the problem. Haha! <laughs> I will harm myself to get what I want. Yeah, that sounded weird me saying that. So, 100%. So, let's just go and kill ourselves. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I was really worried that they were not gonna come. Sometimes they would let you die before if you jumped such, in such an extremely random place that they were like, what? We didn't expect anyone to be here. Now, finding the exit was always a problem for me. Ah, I thought it was here. I win. Okay. Next episode, we will do the other level.